my second day of kindergarten. <laughs> there, 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 there. Has anyone seen my square piece? I can't find my square piece. No. I think you stole my square piece. I didn't steal your square piece. I'm coming. Who stole my square piece? Get out, dog. Your dog and Mrs. Dog Popo. They're not freaking Popo. There's no way it goes, idiot. Shut the blocks up your ass. How about I shove them up yours? Hey guys, how's it going? Don't Okay. Hey, Cody, this piece won't fit. Well, that's because you got the calendar pig confused again, Freddy. Oh, you're so smart, Cody. You should be in a higher grade. Yes, I should be. Hey, Cody, I learned a new word from my dad last night. You want to hear it? Okay. Hooker. Hooker? Yeah, my dad said he wanted to go eat out a hooker. Oh, uh, he must have been talking about a hook and ladder sub from Firehouse Subs. Then why did he say it was going to be so hot? Uh, b because they heat up their subs. Th that's why it's called Firehouse. Is that why he came home with red sauce all over his face? Yeah, he must have gotten a meatball sub instead. Oh, I want a hooker! Miss Fitzpatrick, can I have a hooker? Mikey, stop it! We do not say that word! Why are you getting so mad? A hooker just means a sandwich! No, it's not! If I hear you say that word one more time, you're going in the timeout chair! Okay, jeez! I don't know why she doesn't like sandwiches. All right, class, we're gonna start the day! Class! Class! One, two, three, eyes on me! Be quiet! Good. All right, today, class, I didn't take my Xanax because my prescription ran out. Xanax is a fancy adult word for happy medicine. My dad gives me Xanax! Shut the fuck up, Mikey! All right, class, today is Blue Day. Over the weekend, you were supposed to get three blue things for show and tell. Who wants to go first? Oh, this is Fitzpatrick. Pick me, pick me. I want to go first. Me, me, me. Would anybody else like to go first? Uh, anybody? Oh, what about you, Daryl, huh? There, 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 there. Uh, please, anybody? <gasps> Freddie, how about you? Come on up. Oh, man. Okay. All right, Freddy, what three blue items did you bring? Well, I have my blue bowling pin, and my blue swimming goggles, and my James P. Sullivan Snuggie. Very good, Freddy, but actually you have four blue items because you're wearing a blue striped shirt. Fuck! Does that mean I fail? No, in fact, it means you get a prize out of the prize bucket, which is also blue. Okay, I'm going to choose the Grimace. The prize bucket? Well, that's not fair. Mrs. By not being you, Mikey. Okay, class, who wants to go next? Oh, me, 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 Mrs. Fitzpatrick, me! No, Mikey, you're going last! Oh, wet! Cody, how about you come up? Okay, I'll do it. It's not fucking fail! Hey, give me a toy! No, it's my toy! Give it back! Give it back! Give it back! Give it back! Mikey, give him back his toy! God, I hate him! Having a rough day, Mrs. Fitz? It's okay, Cody. Okay, Cody, what three blue things did you bring? Okay, check this out. I'm wearing it. I got a blue bow tie, a blue shirt, and blue shorts. Very good, Cody. Go ahead and sit down. Huh, okay. <laughs> I just can't help but notice you didn't give me something out of the prize bucket. Well, Cody, you didn't go above and beyond. Freddy brought four blue things. Well, he didn't even know his shirt was blue. His mom dresses him. All right, who wants to go next? Okay, you know what? Fuck you. I'm gonna go rile Mikey up. Don't you dare, Cody. Cody, how about a sticker? Okay, I guess I can take a sticker. <laughs> hey, Mikey, check this out. I got a sticker. Oh, Mrs. Fitzpatrick, I want a sticker. Mikey, if you shut up for the rest of class, I will give you a sticker. Okay. You already lost. Daryl, how about you come up? There, 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 there. Yes, Daryl, come there, on up. There, 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 all right, Daryl, come on up. Now, what three blue things did you bring for show and tell? Uh, oh, very good. You have a blue page in your book. Okay, what else did you bring that's blue? Oh, blue shorts. Very good, Daryl. And what's your third blue thing? Uh, let's see. Um, oh, here we go. A blue bear. Good job, Daryl. Please go sit down. Okay, Mikey, come on. Just let's get this over with. Okay! <laughs> I got some really good stuff. 
Okay, Mikey, what three blue items did you bring? Okay, so for my first item, I have this really cool blue block. Awesome. Okay, what else did you bring? For my second item, I have this really cool blue block. Mikey, did you only bring blue blocks from the class? No, I got a really good last item. For my last item, I got this pair of blue underwear from the backseat of my dad's car. Mikey, where the hell did you get those? I told you I got it from the backseat of my dad's car. Mikey, get out. Get out. Go sit down! Do I get a prize? No, Mikey! Get out of my sight! Go sit down! But I bought three blue things and my pants are blue! That means I bought four things! I deserve a prize! Sit your ass down, Mikey! This is bullshit! Oh, I freaking hate this class! Hey, Mikey, I think your dad might be boning Mrs. Fitzpatrick because you found her underwear in the back of your dad's car. Well, my dad is her top donator on her OnlyFans, so that kind of makes sense. All right, class, I think we only have time for one more show and tell before lunch, and I need lunch to go find myself a Xanax, so who wants to go right now? I'll go! All right, Alex, come on up. Now, what three blue items did you bring? Well, I don't own anything blue, but I got this purple crayon because purple is my favorite color. Okay, well, that is not blue. You were supposed to bring three blue things. But when's it going to be a purple day? I mean, today's blue day. Last week was yellow day. We had a fucking black month. When's it going to be purple day? It's not if you keep talking like that, mister. This is bullshit. All right, class. New rule. No more cussing or I'm putting soap in your mouths. Your parents signed waivers. I can legally do that. Okay, how about lunch? Pull out your lunches and I'm gonna go find me some medicine! Oh, I hate turkey and cheese lunchables! I have nachos! Let me have one! No! Guys, guys, make room for a real pimp. I got a pizza lunchable. Whoa! I've never seen one of those in person before! Only rich kids get to eat those! Yeah, I go band for band. Can I try a piece? No, Mikey, you have fun with your turkey and cheddar. But I wanna try a piece! Yeah, well, I wanna play with your block. Don't touch my Okay, then you can't have my pizza. Can I try it? Sure, Freddy. Why does he get to try it, but I don't? Well, because Freddy's not a dick. Oh, yeah, well, you know what? Ah! What? Don't throw turkey at me. Yeah. All right, class, I'm back. How about that? It was Cody, it was Cody, it was Cody, it was him. See, he has a pizza lunchable. He threw it. Mikey, you friggin' narc. Cody, timeout chair now. <laughs> you go to the timeout chair. That means I can eat your pizza lunchable. Screw off, Mikey. <laughs> Cody, sit in that timeout chair and think about what you've done. I don't want to go to stupid timeout. I don't care, Cody. You know better than to throw food. Well, then Mikey should be in timeout because he threw turkey at me. You're wearing the good boy sticker. You should be setting an example. You didn't find your Xanax, did you? No, I did not. Then what'd you have for lunch? A plan B. Damn, you're having a rough time, aren't you? Yes, I am, Cody. Now shut up and think about what you've done. All right, class, now I'm going to read you a Dr. Seuss book, Hop on Pop. You hopped on my pop in the back of his car. <laughs> God damn it, Mikey, get your ass up here and sit in the timeout chair. Wait, we can't both sit in the timeout chair. Yes, you can until you two can learn how to get along. <sighs> Not freaking Mikey. Oh, man, I didn't even get to finish my Lunchable. Mikey, sit there next to Cody. Move. Why are you pushing me, Mikey? Move your big fat butt. Way. Mikey, so help me God, if you don't cut this shit out, I will call your father. Why? So you can leave more underwear in his car? <laughs> You're making it worse, Mikey. Oh, I'm gonna hit him. Oh, go ahead. You can't hit me harder than my father does. You know what? Maybe you two are all perfect for each other. Damn. All right, class. Hop on, pop. <laughs> my giant, my pop. Cup, pop, pop in cup. Pop, cup, cup on pop. This book is freaking bullying. You know what? Free day! Do whatever the hell you want! Color draw! Play your games! I'm over it! What well, teacher, what about us? Can we go play? You will stay there till you die! But what about me? Can I go play? No! You threw a pizza at the wall! I was throwing it at Mikey! Doesn't he deserve it? No! I don't care! Both of you will sit there, and if you either one of you leave, I will write a note home to your parents! Yeah, more like a love note! <laughs> I want to go play. Why don't you go play then, pussy? Well, because unlike you, my dad's not banging the teacher, and I don't think he'd appreciate getting a note. Well, I'm going to go play with my blocks. My Mikey, what are you doing? Get, get back in the chair, Mikey. Mikey. Woohoo! My blocks are so freaking fun. Mikey. Mikey. Mikey, get back here. If she sees you, she's going to call both our parents. Mikey. Mikey. I'm going to have to get him before she sees. And that one goes right there. Mikey. And that one goes right there. Mikey. And this one goes shit. That Mikey. Right there. What? We have to get back in the chair. We're going to get in trouble. No, I'm playing with my blocks. If the teacher sees us out of the chair, she's going to call our parents. Who cares?
kills! I kill! Well, I don't! I'm gonna play on my blocks! Go, ah, go back! Ah, go back! Ah, help! Help! Ah. Huh? Ooh! Carly, my gay asses are done! Oh, shit. <laughs> Mrs. Fitzpatrick, I pooped in my pull ups! Oh, man, Joseph, school sucked today. I know, it's lucky it's harder and harder. <sighs> hey, guys. Hey, Cody, how was kindergarten? <laughs> It sucked. What do you mean it sucked? I thought you liked it. Well, I liked the first day, but today sucked. The teacher wrote a letter home to my parents. What's it say? It says, Dear Mr. and Mrs. Nutkiss, your son Cody was very rude and disruptive in class today. He backtalked me, argued with the other students, and threw his pizza at the wall. When I put him in timeout, he left without permission. Please speak with your son about how this behavior is unacceptable. Damn, dude, I didn't know you were that much of a savage. I don't want to show this letter to my mom. I'm going to get in so much trouble. Just don't show it to your mom. Oh, yeah, you're right. So you're gonna go back to kindergarten? Oh yeah, I'm gonna go back there and kick Mikey's ass. You're gonna fight a five-year-old? Yeah, and I'm gonna win. What if you don't? Well, I'm gonna. Ow! <laughs> Ow! Yeah, he's not gonna win. No way. Ow, my feet. What are you doing, Cody? I'm practicing for when I beat Mikey up today. You're really gonna beat up a five-year-old in kindergarten? Yeah, he's not gonna be such a bad kid once I kick his ass. See, that's what kids need these days. Good old ass whooping. Open up a can of whoop ass. Your glove fell off, Cody. I know, I'll get it. Okay, well, I just think it's weird that you're 16 years old and you're gonna beat up a five-year-old. Dude, he's four, remember? Oh yeah, you're four years old. Yeah, he's actually older than me, so, so it's fine if I kick his ass. It's fine. There, there, there. Telescope Tiger! Hey, Mikey. Hey, don't touch my airport! I don't want to touch your shitty airport. Actually, that's a pretty sick airport. Yeah, I got four different color planes. Red, blue, green, and yellow. Yeah, those are four colors. Yeah, so don't touch my airport. It's been very busy today. There's been a lot of delays. Well, there's about to be a lot more delays. Why? How are they going to fly without a control tower? Hey! Yeah, that's what happens, Mikey. That's what happens. Hey, don't do that! Yeah, you fuck with the fuck. Hey, hey, stop! Hey. Yeah, my mom was very upset with my behavior. You know my dad got the note you wrote because you got in his car again last night! Shut up, Mikey! But you did! He gave you 50 bucks! What were you selling? Mikey, shut up or you're going in time out! Mikey, you are making me feel very angry! Which brings me to today's lesson class. Today is Feelings Friday, and we're going to talk about our feelings. Sometimes you can feel mad like I am at Mikey right now. Sometimes you can feel sick like I was this morning. I've been throwing up a lot for some reason. But sometimes you can also feel in love. You're in love with my dad. You know he doesn't love you, right? That's why he hits you. He doesn't love me either because he hits me too. Mikey, you you're making me feel sad, and I would like to feel happy for once! Oh, oh I feel like I'm gonna throw up again! <laughs> Alright class, today we're gonna go around one by one and talk about how we feel today! <laughs> Daryl, you first! <laughs> I'm feeling pretty mad at Mikey. I want to beat his ass. But I really want to do a Dragon City ad first. Can I please be excused? Yes, Cody, but hurry up! Thanks, Teach. It'll only be a minute. Hey, Dragon Masters. We're back with another video sponsored by Dragon City. And this time, we have a very exciting announcement for all SML fans. Dragon City has added a free exclusive SML decoration now available in-game. That's right. Your very own piece of the SML universe just waiting to be planted right in the heart of your Dragon Empire. There's so much to do in this game. Dragon City is a whole kingdom of over 1,000 unique dragons waiting for you to collect, hatch, and evolve them. From fire-breathing giants, all the way to mystical creatures inspired by some of your favorite YouTubers. With over 450 
million installs. Joining this adventure means being part of a growing community where you can team up in alliances and unlock exclusive rewards together. Or you can head into PvP battles to prove your strength and climb the leaderboard. It's a world where every Dragon Master plays a part in a larger story. So if you're not part of this Dragon Dynasty yet, now's the perfect time. Click the link in the description or scan the QR code to jump in. You'll get the exclusive SML decoration for your city, plus 15,000 food, 30,000 gold, and the epic OV Dragon to kickstart your journey. But hurry, it's a limited time offer, so grab it while you can, and we'll see you in game. <sighs> okay, I'm back. <coughs> <laughs> that was very nice, Cody. Now, kids, I'm going to go to the bathroom and take a test. You guys play your games and try to think about how you're feeling. Wow, Mrs. Fitzpatrick is really sick. She must have cooties for my dad. Yeah, I think she's taking a pregnancy test. What's that? It's the thing that you put under your tongue and it tells you how hot you are. That's a thermometer, Freddy. But now that the teacher's out of the room, I'm going to kick your ass, Mikey. Why? Because you got us in trouble and the teacher wrote a note home to my mom. But guess what, Mikey? I didn't give my mom that note. Ooh, I'm gonna tell Miss Fitzpatrick! Well, how are you gonna tell her anything with a broken lip? What? Yeah, that's right! Stay down, Mikey, you pussy! Yeah, does anybody else want some? Who do you think you are? I am! Cody! Cody! Yeah! Cody. Yeah, I wanted to go just like that. Hey, Mikey, I'm gonna kick your ass! What? <laughs> yeah, how you like that? Ow! Ow! Oh, God, he's by my ear! He's by my ear! Freddy, get him the fuck off me! Oh, God, it hurts! It hurts! Somebody help me! Oh, 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 he bit my fucking ear off! All right, class, I have to wait 15 minutes to see if this test is negative, which hopefully it is. Oh, my God! Cody, what's wrong? Yeah! Cody, Cody, what's wrong? Mikey bit my ear off! Mikey Gerard Tyson, you do not bite people's ears! Wait, Tyson? His name is Mikey Tyson and he bit my ear off like Mike Tyson? I'm calling the principal right now! Wait, where's my ear? Has anybody seen my ear? It's right over here! Quick, put it on ice! Alright, everybody, shut up! It's me, your principal, Mr. Steinbeck! <laughs> and your teacher right here, Mrs. Fitzpatrick. Ooh, yeah, she told me there was a little bit of a tussle in here. Over there! Over there? Okay. <laughs> Okay. I heard you two have a problem with fighting in class. He bit my ear off. Well, look, rub some dirt in it. This is kindergarten. Life gets a lot harder than this. He, he punched me in the face first. Look, I'll punch the both of you in the face if Miss Thick Patrick over there tell me about you two fighting that class again. Okay. You got me? Yes. You got that, yes, sir. Oh, okay, okay, okay. And I'm going to keep your ear. But why? Because I like it. it it's cool. <laughs> and let me address the class. All right, everybody, shut up. Mrs. Fitzpatrick over here walks in my class every single day and tells me this. Oh, my class is horrible. My students are from hell. Who birthed these demons? If I had a time machine, I would go back in time and murder every single parent so they couldn't even reproduce. Oh, these are the things I hear. Man, and Mrs. Fitzpatrick, she got an ass on her. Woohoo! Man, talk about a wagon and that ass is dragging. It should be illegal in all 50 states, honestly, even in Canada. <laughs> but uh, that's besides the point. <sighs> Look, if you little hell spawns make another ruckus in this class, do anything, fight, ah, break something, I don't care. I swear to God, there will be a mass murder. Uh, I mean, someone will, be, someone will be expelled. A lot of people will be expelled. <laughs> my bad about that. Uh, so, uh, how's my son, Daryl? Well, he loves his bear. Bear, 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 bear. Can we try to get him to learn a different animal? Well, he screams every time. <sighs> Let me talk to him. Bear, 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 hey, there, old son, buddy. Uh, bear, how about we try a different animal, like bear, the giraffe? No! Don't do it! Don't fucking do it! It's my son! I know how to talk to my son! Bear, Look, bear, how about we try the giraffe? giraffe. <laughs> right, bear, bear, oh, call them! Bear, 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 bear! See, see? Bear. Oh, fuck it, you win. Oh. He really likes that damn beer. It haunts my dreams. <sighs> Just don't make him mad, ever, or you're fired. I know. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> it's positive. <laughs> hey, class, your teacher? She's sad. <laughs> Principal Steinbeck out! <laughs> wait, wait. Mrs. Fitzpatrick, if you ever need some extra cash, bring that ass this way. <laughs> Yeah, I want to change my answer. I'm not keeping it. Uh, Mikey, no, uh, I'm texting your father right now. I mean, yes, Mikey, go ahead and tell us how you feel. <laughs> the medicine I'm 
Oh, it makes me not feel anything. I am in so much pain. I am missing my fucking ear. Very good. Freddy, how about you? I feel stinky because I pooped in my pull-ups when the pointer ball was yelling. That's very nice. Clarissa, you gotta keep the baby. No, I don't, Randy. What about all that good loving I've been giving you? It wasn't love, Randy. It was a service. Ooh, look at that tall glass of water. And I am thirsty. <laughs> Randy, I told you not to come to my place of work. You embarrassing me? Yes. Hey, Dad! That's my dad, guys. Mikey, shut up before I slap the shit out of you. He's the worst child I've ever had the displeasure of teaching. Well, we can raise one together. I'm not keeping it, Randy! Yes, the hell you is! Last time I saw my dad this mad, he killed my mom and my unborn brother. Uh, I, I know you guys are having relationship problems, but I'm actively bleeding over here. The principal stole my ear. Can I please go home? Why you ain't want to kid with me? Where do I start, Randy? You're a bum. Yeah, you got a bum. Look at that dumpy. Oh, Randy, you don't even have a real job. Oh, yeah, what about my SoundCloud that I get 32 listens to on? That's one for each day of the month. That's not a real job, Randy, and there's 30 days in a month, sometimes 31. And sometimes there's 33 depending on the year. That's not what a leap year is, Randy! Oh, yeah? Well, my career's about to leap this year. Yes, sir. On the 4th of Neverwary. Please, can I go to the nurse? I'm losing so much blood. Listen, Randy, can we talk about this later? You gonna take me to McDonald? <sighs> sure. You gonna get me a 20-piece with the sweet and sour sauce? Sure. In your nice-ass car? Fella, she got a nice-ass car now. A 2006 Buick LeSabre. Yes, sir! That shit so clean it looked like it just came right off the lot. I don't care. I am in so much pain. Randy, if you leave right now, we can do the thing we did the other night. Okay! <laughs> Class, I'm so... So sorry. Bye, Dad! That's my dad. So you've said, Mrs. Fitzpatrick, I'm missing my ear. Can I please go to the nurse? Not right now, Cody. Maybe in a little bit. In a little bit? Am I going insane? Why is nobody helping me? Hey there, Miss Fitzpatrick. I'm here to do that procedure. Let's get that thing out of there. Oh, good, a doctor. Doctor, please help me. I'm missing my ear. Just a second, kid. I gotta do this procedure first. Just a second? Are you kidding me? My ear is gone. All right, open up. Wait, right here? Well, yeah, you want it done, right? I guess. Okay, I just gotta numb it first. Num, 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 num. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But seriously, though, this, this thing does have teeth. Uh, class, um, I'm feeling a little scared. How about everyone goes home for today? Thank God, I'm out of here. Uh, Mrs. Fitzpatrick, can you give me a ride home? My dad already left. Nom, 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 nom. No, nom, Mikey! Nom. Wait, hold on. Where's my little shark thing? Oh, there it is. I wonder if Cody won his fight. Yeah! yeah well, God. Cody, what happened to you? Mikey bit my ear off. Wait, like Mike Tyson? Exactly like Mike Tyson. Oh, shit. Mikey Tyson? That's literally his name. No way. Yes way. He bit my ear off and the principal stole it. What, the principal took your ear? Yeah. Well, why are you here? You need to go to a hospital. I know. I just wanted to tell you guys how my day was. I, I'm, I'm going. That... That's, that can't be right. Talk about a bad day, dude. Yeah, I know. Kindergarten must be really tough. Thank you again to Dragon City for sponsoring this video. Click the link in the description for your special SML decoration and a bundle of rewards. Hey guys, it's Logan. We officially launched an SML gaming channel. Go subscribe right now. We're going to be uploading gaming videos every single day, just like this Roblox one you see on your screen right now. So please go subscribe to the new SML gaming channel for new content every single day. What? You can get a lot of momentum in this bitch. No! Yeah, you really can. Oh, oh I'm dead! Dead! I got hit in the face by ball. So, guys, what do you want to do today? Well, the 7th Annual Talent Show's tonight. Me and Timmy are entering. A talent show? What kind of talent do you butt buddies have besides stretching your butts? Well, Timmy can sing. Well, so can you. Aww. I want to join the talent show. What talent do you have, Junior? Uh, I could do magic tricks. No, you can't. Yeah, I can. I'll be the best magician ever, and I'll beat you guys. Oh, dude, I'm going to join the talent show. What talent do you have? My talent is on my shirt, dude. The color green is not a talent. Dude, you're stupid. It's obviously balling. Well, don't steal our idea. Ew, not that ball. Basketball, idiot. I want to do talent show. Alright, how about we all join the talent show and whoever wins 
wins. Well, that is how it works, yeah. You're going down, guys. Yeah. Let's say you're all going down. Hello and welcome to the seventh annual talent show. The winner today will win this big gold trophy and a million dollars. Now let's meet the judges. The first judge is Leroy Butterbottom. Hello, everybody. The next judge is the always mad and never impressed bald Simon Cowell. I am not amused. I don't care about anything. And the third judge is the daughter of Hubba Bubba, Lisa Bubba. I'm chewing double bubble because I hate my dad. Your gum sucks, dad. Let the talent show begin. Hi, everybody. My name's Penelope, and I can hula hoop for a really long time. Go. <laughs> what the hell was that? Oh, sweetie, never try that again. That was so terrible, it made one of my kidneys fail. Ouch. I'm so sorry! <laughs> Who's next? Mike. Mike, the curtains are open. Huh? Oh, hey everybody! I am Brooklyn Guy, and this here is my partner, Simmons. Hello, everyone! Hello. And today, we, we I, I mean I, I am going to be shooting an apple off of Simmons' head while blindfolded and plastered drunk. If I got behind the wheel of a car right now, <laughs> I'd kill somebody. All right, Simmons, you ready? Yeah, bud, let's go. Okay, Apple, where are you, little scamp? Let me see. Oh, that feels right, okay. <laughs> what, what, did I get it? Did I hit the apple? Oh, fuck. Oh, no, I just killed Simmons. Da, na, na, na. <laughs> Guys, we saw someone die! I've seen better homicides in a Looney Tune. Hey everyone, I'm Junior the Magician! And he sucks! I don't suck, I'm actually good at magic. You guys be the judge if I suck or not. So today's trick, I'm gonna be sawing Chef Pee Pee in half! No the hell he's not! I have to for the talent show. No you're not, you're not sawing me in half and killing me for a talent show! I'm not gonna actually kill you Chef Pee Pee. Well we're not gonna find out cause you're not sawing me in half. Please? No! <sighs> okay, sorry everyone, there was a change in today's trick lineup. Mm -hmm. uh, the next trick, I'm gonna make Chef Pee Pee disappear! Here. Just put this blanket over him. What? Put the blanket over him. All right. And on the count of three, Chef Pee Pee's going to disappear in front of your eyes. One. Ow! Two. That hurts, Junior. Three. God damn it, I'm out of here. Ta-da! I made Chef Pee Pee disappear. Oh my God, where did he go? He just disappeared out of thin air. Oh my God, it's crazy. Two stretchy buttholes. Two stretchy buttholes for me. I'm not impressed. Are there any more tricks? Okay, for my final trick, I will be grabbing a random card from this deck of cards, showing it to the judges, and then putting the card back in the deck, and then letting one of the judges shuffle the deck, and then I will then find that card I showed the judges. Okay. Uh, this card. What card is that? Don't tell me. I will grab a different card. This one. Okay, I, I do not know which card that is, and I will grab the deck and hand it to the judge. All right, who would like to shuffle the deck? Oh, me, me, get my knickers wet. <laughs> Did he just say a bad word? He can say it. You suck at shuffling. Will you shuffle him? Okay. It doesn't have to be that good, just, just, just anything. I'm doing it, do it my way. Oh. All right, okay. I have gotten the deck back from the judges, and it's all shuffled. There's no way I would know the card I just showed you guys. That's why. It's going to be the one that I choose right now. Is this the card I showed you earlier? No. It's not? No, it's not. Oh. Well, I had a 1 in 52 chance, and I didn't get it. But if I would have gotten it, that would have been crazy. Good night, everybody. My god, does anyone have any real talent in this town? Who's next? Me, slap me, spit on me, and choke me, daddy. Touch
touch my body, make me happy, make my cheeks go clappy, clappy. Hi, my name is Timmy's daddy, slurps on me cause I'm a baddie. Gaining weight, my schlong is fatty, eats it like a crabby patty. Why me daddy, harder daddy, I need to be punished daddy. Take it Timmy, tug it Timmy, you need to be punished Timmy. Take this wood, like you should, damn Timmy it feels so good. Feels so good because that's how it's supposed to feel. <sighs> thank you, everybody. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Timmy. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Can't forget this. Oh my god, I love it! I love it! Bravo, Encore Oscar! <laughs> that would be a Grammy. They deserve all of them! They did perfect! Oh my god, I loved it! <laughs> that was the most homosexual thing I've ever seen. I kind of like that. I loved it! Hi guys, my name's Joseph, and I'm gonna do the sickest, nastiest slam dunk ever recorded. I'm gonna alley oop it to myself off the backboard, 360 slam dunk windmill. Watch this. Huh? <laughs> 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 what, bitch? I'm cold before the helicopter, nigga. Fuck with your boy, yeah. The dunk, uh, it was splendid, but I could deal with that, the Kobe comments. <laughs> Throwing a ball in a hoop is not impressive. I thought it was cool. Oh my god, he's like LeBron James. Hello, today my name is Screwball, and I'm a clown, and my talent is, is I make animal balloons out of balloons for kids at their birthday parties. So my first animal is a snake. The next animal is a worm. The next animal is a caterpillar with no legs. And the next animal is an eel. And the next animal is a centipede with no legs. And the next animal is a crocodile with no legs and no arms. And the next animal is uh, a green giraffe with no legs. This is just a dinosaur dick. And for my grand finale, Kermit the Frog's dick. Ta-da! I noticed that all of them were like the same shape. Duh, that's the magic. He's only making one balloon. Why not make a dog? Or Perhaps a spider. All those are too hard. They're not too hard because I made a dog under the table while you were doing all of that. Find a new talent because this one isn't it. You make me sick. I'm sorry. Will someone please come out with some goddamn talent? Hey everybody, my name is Patrick and I'm a ventriloquist. And this here is my ventriloquist dummy. I'm not a dummy, you're the dummy! Little Patrick, that's not very nice. Now little Patrick, what do you like to do for fun? Well there's not much I can do with your hand up my butt! Little Patrick, you're not supposed to tell people I put my hand up your butt, but I just want you to stop doing it! Please! Shut up, little Patrick. I'm now going to take a sip of water while I let little Patrick do all the talking. <laughs> hey, everybody! I'm little Patrick! It's really hard to talk when you drink the water. <laughs> I almost drowned. I wish you had drowned! Little Patrick, that's not nice! I'm gonna go give you a spanking. Good night, everybody! Little Patrick, I can't believe you embarrassed me like that out there. Well, I just want you to stop putting your hand in my butt. I won't put my hand in your butt. I'd like to see you try, Little Patrick. Okay. <laughs> Get your hand in my butt, Little Patrick. Somebody help me. Somebody help me. Little Patrick, get his hand in my butt. I'm starting to think he's controlling that thing. No shit, Nimrod. Is that his little brother? Hey, hey there. I'm homeless, but I don't know how to juggle. I don't want to juggle these beer bottles. Usually they whistle. Back to juggling. All right. Oh, damn. Okay. Well, good night, everybody. Thank you. Is security not checking who's coming in here? Maurice, don't let any more goddamn hobos in the building. Hey, everyone. My name is Jeffy, and my talent is that I can do impressions. Go on. Hot. 
dog. How's it going, everybody? Who wants to see my right dick, huh? -huh? Miss Piggy, I know you're a genie on me, you two timing slut. You bang Bert and Ernie at the same time. I gag 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 go to the strip club, but that costs me money. I gag 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 gag. Something came in the mail today. These nuts. Ha! Got him! <laughs> Got him! Hello, my friend! I've never flown a plane before. What up with that building, Maurice? Ah! <laughs> Name's George W. Plane just hit the South Tower. My bad. <laughs> oh my god, that was amazing! How do you have that many people inside you? <laughs> I've never had that many people inside me. Maybe a few. No, but like really? How did he do that? How did he have so many voices coming out of him? <laughs> Mimicking people with actual talent is not a talent. Get off my stage. That was the last contestant! Let's see who the judges choose to be the winner! If it were up to me, all of these contestants would lose. I refuse to pick a winner and you can't make me. Well, I love the gay song, but that's just me. Oh my god, me too! Really? Yeah! Oh my god. <laughs> well, how about my balloon dog? Yeah, that was pretty cool. It was pretty nice. Who votes I win? Mm. Mm. That settles it. I keep my million dollars. Thanks for watching. See you next season. Ooh, for the seventh year in a row, it looks like bald Simon Cowell wins! I can't believe none of us won. Yeah, dude, that judge totally robbed us! Bald Simon Cowell does that every year. He's won seven years in a row with his stupid balloon animals. And nobody saw that coming? I really thought our song could beat his balloon animal this year. Well, what about my magic tricks? You got the card wrong, Junior. Nah, my dunk would've brought Kobe back to life, nigga. Damn, Joseph, that's two Kobe jokes in one video. Calm down. But it's true! Well, I made Chef Pee Pee disappear. Pier. I did voices. Yes, you did. Uh, Cody, you forgot to get the other ball out. There were two up there? Damn. Yes, he was on the third story. Yes, he completely got on fire, jumped out the window, and look, he landed on his fingers! Yeah, you never want to land fingers first. That's how you break your fingers. I was trying to catch myself. Yeah, I can see that. So, buddy, how much pain are you in? A lot. Hmm, well, that's not helpful. Nurse, get the Wong Baker pain scale. All right, I got it. Now, sir, which of these faces represents your pain? Ugh, the crying one. Well, I don't see you crying, so you're lying. Sir, his tear ducts burnt off in the fire. Oh, okay. Well, I think we should probably do a skin graft. Oh, I already got one. No, nurse, not a skin pie chart, a skin graft. Oh, okay. N no, not a skin bar graft, a skin graft. Um, let me look. N no, not a skin graft, a skin graft. Well, I don't know what that is! Well, it's where you take new skin and you graft it onto his body. Ew! Look, just go into the skin drawer and get some new skin. All right, uh, sir, what color would you like? Uh, white. Ugh, everybody always picks white. Even Michael Jackson picked white. I'll go look. Uh, what's wrong with your head? What, my head? Yeah, you're bald. Well, I am losing a little bit of hair. No, on the back, it's really bad. Well, I do have a bald spot, yeah. Ha ha, bald! Well, you're bald too! Yeah, but I had hair before the fire. I'd rather look like this than look like you, baldy. <laughs> Sir, all we have is black. <sighs> Mervyn, let's watch a movie. Well, what movie do you want to watch? I don't know. Well, you're the one who wants to watch a movie, you gotta pick. What do you want, Jeffy? Ha, I got your mustache! Well, Jeffy, give me my mustache back! No, ha, sure! Give it back, Jeffy! Alright, now here you go. <laughs> Marvin, it looks like you have a unibrow! Alright, everyone, <laughs> shut up! <sighs> Ugh, there's someone at the door. Let me fix my mustache and answer it. Hello? Hold on, let me just finish up this text. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong, buddy? Somebody made fun of me and hurt my feelings! <laughs> Well, like, you were just texting, so it just seems like you're- <laughs> I'm so sad. Seems like you're crying for attention. No, I'm crying because my feelings got hurt. Well, come on and explain it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Aw, why 
Why is he crying? Someone hurt his feelings. His name was Curtis. Curtis hurt his feelings. Well, his name was Curtis Furtis. Curtis Furtis hurt his feelings. Well, that wasn't very nice of Curtis Furtis. What did Curtis Furtis say to you? Well, Curtis Furtis was a burn victim, and he came into the ER, and he made fun of me for being bald. You're not bald. I'm a little bald. <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> okay, you're really not that bald. Well, there's all kinds of mean things I could have said to the burn victim, like, you look like Anakin Skywalker after he lost his fight, or you look like Deadpool without his mask on, or you look like Paul Walker after the car accident. But I didn't say those things. I was the bigger man, and I ran away crying. Well, I think you should just not deal with that patient anymore. Well, I just came here to ask you how you live with being ugly and bald. I'm not bald. Eh, you're kind of bald. I have hair on the sides of my head. Marvin, if you stood outside in direct sunlight, you could blind someone. But I am not bald, I have hair! Marvin, sometimes at night I pretend you're Dr. Phil so I can get off. I get that. What? Dr. Phil is a very fine man. When he said, it doesn't matter how much you flatten a pancake, it still has two sides, that made me want to have sex with him. I do not look like Dr. Phil. I know, because if you did, I'd want to have sex with you. All right, let's get back on track. You are not that bald. I know, I just wish I looked as good as I did in high school. I had so much hair, I was so hot. Oh, the things I'd do to my high school self. I, I mean, I wouldn't do anything with my high school self because he's in high school and that would be illegal and chronologically impossible. But if I was back in high school with me when I was in high school, I would probably still bang my sex ed teacher, Miss Thickums. She was in the last video. You should check that out. And the new gaming channel. We're doing that now. Anyway, I want hair. Well, why don't you just do a hair transplant? Well, I, I would have to do it myself because I'm the only doctor in town, so I'd have to do it like I did my own vasectomy. And let me tell you, it is a bit of a mess down there. Whenever I pee, my balls fill up like water balloons. That's not normal. No, it's not. I really got to get back in there and figure that out. Well, why don't you just go to a makeover person and get a makeover? Well, I don't know any makeoverologists, do you? Well, Chef Pee, -Pee has a gay cousin. Ooh, did you say gay and cousin and Chef Pee, -Pee? And has? Yeah, I can go ask Chef Pee Pee if his cousin will give you a makeover. Okay, do it! Alright. Ooh, whoop it up the grease! Whoop it up the grease! Whoop it up the grease! Hey, Chef Pee Pee. Oh, what's up, Marvin? You want some instant grits? I made them from scratch. No, I don't really want grits, and I don't think that's how you make them. I know how to make grits. I'm making them from scratch. This is exactly how you make it in a pan. Look, I feel like a southern black lady in the kitchen. Go and get you some grits. Go get you that bowl over there and get some grits. I know you look as skinny as hell. No, I, I don't want any grits. Listen, don't you have a gay cousin who's like a hairstylist? Oh, yeah, I know who you're talking about. Gay Tony. <sighs> gay Tony? Yeah, that's his name. He's gay and his name is Tony. <laughs> he told us to call him that. Well, can you call him over? Because I have a friend that wants a complete makeover. Oh, yeah. He would love to give your friend a makeover. Shit, I need a makeover myself. I'm looking dingy as hell. Look at my outfit. Goddamn. Well, why don't you just call Gay Tony over because we really need him. <sighs> yeah, I'll call him over, but I'm going to warn you. Stay five steps away from him. He likes to kiss all over you. All right, hold still. All right, Chef Pee called his cousin and he's on his way over. Look, Marvin, I'm fixing it. Is she Marvin or is she lying? Uh, it doesn't look good at all. Oh, you bitch. Oh, why I oughta. Okay, hold on. Listen, the hairstylist is on his way. Makeoverologist? Yeah, that. That must be him. You just stay right here. Hello. Oh, my God. You must be Marvin. You must be gay Tony. Oh, what? My appetite for penis! Uh, excuse me, my bad. Uh, had a cough in my throat. <laughs> you little silly goose, man. You look so handsome. Cute. Oh, give me a kiss. We just met. Wait, I don't want to give you a kiss. Listen, I need you here for a makeover for my friend. Oh, I can't wait to do that makeover. I love doing makeovers. Oh, I wish you were the makeover, though. I'm not. I'm not. But he's upstairs. Come on. Oh, oh my God. I can't wait. Gay Tony's here. Oh, my God. I'm so happy to meet all of you. Oh, I love your necklace. Oh, my God. Thanks. Slay Queen. You're awesome. Girl, let me tell you about today. The hottest guy walked into my salon. I'm talking about a dream boat, a real man. And he needed to use the bathroom. And I'm like, sir, the bathroom is open for business. Piss on my face already. <laughs> he just kissed me. I love that for you. I love it for me too. Now where is that makeover? He's right there. Oh my God, is that Dr. House? Oh my God, he's a real doctor, right? I am a doctor. A doctor, yeah. yeah. Oh! Bags. I can't wait till after this makeover. I might have to do him. Mm. No, thank you. I'm good. My hair's just a little patchy. Ooh, I love me a redhead. There's something fiery about them. Oh, likes a fire under my bottom. I like my herpes. Oh, I just recently had an outbreak. He kissed me on my mouth. Eee! Oh, kisses for everybody. No, no, no I'm no, good. Thank you. Okay. okay um, uh, what do we need for this? Uh, this do over. Uh, so he, he needs his hair fixed, his eyes fixed. Do, you do know what I need? I need a gay montage to think of this over. Come on, let's get it started. Gay montage.
do? I'm so tall. Look at my legs, Marvin. Oh, my nuts. <laughs> I'm back. Oh my god, you have a little boo-boo. Let me kiss it. Let me kiss no, it. No, 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 it's okay. Oh, fine. Thanks for the legs, man. Yeah, no problem. I gave you two new legs, and uh, I can't wait to see the third one. <laughs> yeah, I do wish you would have helped me out more in that department, and I still have to fix the vasectomy situation. But hey, look at my mustache, Marvin. It's so fuzzy like a caterpillar. And look at my hair. Go ahead and touch it. I know you want to. It feels like a giraffe. Okay, well, you don't know your animals, but thank you. Yep, no patches! Marvin, he's so hot! What? You think he's hot? Yeah, look how tall he is! Yeah, look how tall I am, Marvin. Hey, how's the ground down there? That's what tall people say. We're both standing on the same ground. Yeah, but I'm further away from it, so I don't know what my next step's gonna be like, so I need you tiny people to tell me. We're standing on my couch. Yeah, that's kind of weird, now that you mention it. I mean, how big is this couch? I mean, if this were to scale, this couch would be fucking massive. Really, your whole house would be. How high are your ceilings? That's weird. Anyway, back to puppet land. Can you make me as hot as him? No, I'm busy. Oh, I got a grinder appointment with Enrique, oh, my spicy little chorizo. But, uh, how are you gonna pay me? <laughs> with money? Oh, fine. Venmo me then. He, he didn't give me his Venmo. That's okay. I'm sure he'll remember. Anyway, I'm off to the strip club. Wait, you, you finally look really good and you're going to the strip club? Well, yeah. When you look this good, you don't have to pay to impress women. Well, then why would you go to a strip club? Those women only want money. Well, they're gonna want me because I'm so handsome. But like, I don't understand why you'd go- Just to let me hop away! Why are you hopping? I haven't had legs in years. I want to hop. Short tooth. Move aside, big spender. I'm tall and handsome. Oh my god, yes you are. What's your name, miss? My name's Stardust. Nice to meet you, Stardust. You are very attractive. I would like to have intercourse with you. For free. Oh my god, babe, with legs like those, you can have me. I have legs too. Yeah, but you're short. I am same height. And he has a full head of hair. Yeah, the hair, the hair, yes, that's right, I have hair. So come on, Stardust, let's blow this Popsicle stand. Oh my god, is your name Popsicle stand? <laughs> oh, I like where this is headed. Let's go back to my house. Honey, I'm home. Oh, Bunny, I missed you. <gasps> oh my god, Bunny, did you get a new suit? Well, yeah, I did, but what else do you notice? Did you get a tan? Well, maybe a little bit, but that's not the main attraction. Oh, who's your friend? She's a stripper. Oh, where'd you meet her? At the strip club. Boy, I thought you were at work as a doctor. I was, and then something happened. What? I got legs, Karen. Oh my god, Boyd, where'd you get those? A gay man gave them to me, and now I'm going to leave you for her. What, what, Boyd? Because I'm hot, and she's hot, and that's the way the world works. But Oh, I'm sorry, Karen. I don't want to be with you anymore. <laughs> get naked, please. That stupid man steal my stripper before I get to see tit? <laughs> hey there. Do you see a man with orange mustache inside? He's on the couch with the stripper. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pow right in the kisser. Oh man, that was great. I didn't have to take my suit off. Anyway, you can leave. The post-nut clarity's starting to kick in. Yeah, you see tit before me? Hey, I did more than see tit. I motorboated. I kill you! What? No! No, what are you doing? What are you doing to my leg? No! Don't cut my legs off! He's cutting my legs off! You can't see it, but he's cutting them off and it hurts so bad! All right, sir, here are your discharge papers. Thank you. You sure you don't want that skin graft? Uh, no. My legs! Doctor, what happened? Some psychopath cut off my new legs. But, doctor, these are prosthetics. I know, but they look so nice. Well, you still look nice. <laughs> oh, sir, sir, stop it! What are you doing? I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, okay? I just, I'm hot now, I don't know the rules, I feel like I can do whatever I want, I'm sorry, okay? Just uh, please don't report me to HR. Actually, the HR lady is kind of hot. No, 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 don't, 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 don't do that. Well... No, no, I'm, I'm just kidding. Don't, don't report me. My legs! Hey guys, it's Logan. We officially launched an SML gaming channel. Go subscribe right now. We're going to be uploading gaming videos every single day, just like this Roblox one you see on your screen right now. So please go subscribe to the new SML gaming channel for new content every single day. Push, put, click the, click the forward arrow again, I guess. I promise you I'm pressing it. I'm clicking the hell out of it. I fell. We're having a good time. <laughs> oh my oh, God. Damn, what the hell? Oh, what, what the fuck is what? happening, Joseph? Oh, we're going to get beheaded. Know. Oh my God. It's Joseph. That doesn't make Help. sense. Help. 